I know a lot of you guys have been saying I've been wearing the same thing and my top is always dirty. It's not dirty. It stains. <laughs> And if it's dirty, it is clean. It's just because I'm the biggest klutz. I'm so clumsy. And whenever I eat, I drop things on myself. I don't know why, but I don't know. I felt like I needed to tell you guys why. <laughs> but I do wash my clothes very regularly and I don't smell. At least I don't think so. So welcome back to our house that we are restoring. I've been reading some of your comments since the last batch I pre-recorded and uh, I'm pre-recording because we're moving and there were some really great comments there. Some of you guys were saying, oh, by the way, it is the first day of spring. I might just move my face cam across and now I'm not blocking as much. So I read some of you guys were saying that you don't want to see um, catch up stuff on camera, like you prefer seeing everything because I've been doing quite a bit off camera thinking, oh, that's a bit boring to watch, but you guys actually do want to see it, which I found to be really surprising. So um, I will try and do more on camera. Why are there so many of these creepy dolls everywhere? And Eric, I don't even know what he's doing right now. Oh, he's summoning Bone Hilda. God, these creepy dolls are like taking over the house. Um, also, I mentioned this a while ago, but a few of the videos were demonetized. I just don't know why that happens. Uh, and it, <laughs> I love all the patch he's draw. It seems to affect like the whole playlist as well. So that was a bit of a shame, but I'm gonna try really hard not to show them in the shower. I keep doing it though. Um, also, this violin is 15,000 simoleons to replace, so what the heck. Oh, why don't we just have a, um, a little chat to Bone Hilda, maybe she can encourage us a little bit. And Tora's feeling pretty good. Uh, Tora's feeling really good, actually. Can you get this off the bed? No. Damn it, whenever they go on the bed, you just have to wait for them to change spots. Grim is still stuck at the top of the stairs. I just find that to be so funny. Let's mop this and fix the toilet as well. And actually, I think I did build a table so we can sell this as well. Oh, and we have some Christmas roses to plant. It says it's gorgeous at all times. So I don't know if that means like we can grow it at all times or if it's only a winter flower. Oh, I think I have some down here. Christmas rose bush, seasons winter. Okay, well, it's sheltered, so I think it'll grow here anyway. We just put a couple of these down here, and then we can plant those. And then these sell for a lot of moolah, so like six, $56 each. Yes, please, thank you. And then we got our money tree over here. Yes! I don't really understand how sell all and sell money fruit uh, are different. I guess they're the same. And then we have two more money trees that'll grow here as well. So that's all good and well. All of these are fixed, which is crazy. Usually they are never fixed. Oh, I've got some roses over here. So, you know, we're definitely on our way to fixing up this place. Ooh, and let's open this up. Okay, we got, um, we got something in there. Okay, we can sell a few of these on the table outside. We have so many upgrade pods. In my mind, I was like, oh yeah, we'll we'll do some upgrade stuff. I never have the right upgrade parts. Do you guys find that? Actually, we should extract all of these fossils as well. What about if I do collecting off screen? Or do you, oh my gosh, we just completed the fossils collection. Oh my gosh. I did not expect to have finished that collection. Oh my gosh, we have so many fossils to sell. Okay, let's just load up all of these. And if we sell them all, we should be making a pretty penny. I want to sell a cow berry or cow plant berry, I should say. I mean, I don't really feel like I want to grow it. Originally, I thought you could extend the challenge by trying to get every single flower in the garden, but I don't think we'll do that for this series. Okay, well, there's plenty to sell on our table. It's going to take a while to sell everything, actually. So we can uh, stock that. And Eric will take care of a couple of your needs. He's not feeling 100% today. Ooh, and we can replace this. So now this bathroom's finalized. Is there anything else we need to... Ooh, we can replace this. Thank you. Um, And yeah, also, if you want to make the challenge harder or more difficult, obviously, you wouldn't get money trees because that is a way to make this challenge easier. So not everyone likes to do that. I'm going to replace all of these as well. Yay! And we actually also need a bathtub. 
Hello, Maddie speaking. So I was wanting to get these beautiful uh, vampire bathtubs. Also, I just spilt tea all over my keyboard. So I'm really surprised it's still working. I actually think another mirror would look good here. Oh, and we need another basin. Okay, that bathroom's looking nice, even though we can't really see all of it. Uh, is this bed only? Oh my gosh, I thought it was only $275 to replace. I'm like, no, I swear this was like the most expensive bed. We can replace a couple of things around it. Place the lights. Oh, it's just so nice to see this. these rooms come to life again. There we go. Ooh, this is a pretty room. We can kind of see what it looks like. We also need to do a little bit of dusting in here. Oh, actually, I just realized there's no lights in this bathroom. Let's put a, a couple of lights in there. Beautiful. Oh, and then the lights just went out. Cool. Great. <laughs> All right, let's tend the table and have a yard sale. I don't know why you would put two of the same thing on the table when we have so much stuff to sell, but I feel like we're becoming really well known for our fossil collection, which reminds me that should be in home inventory, our award. Oh, I thought we were getting an award. Oh, we must get it in the mail. How much of these? 15 smillions? Whoops. Yeah, they're both pretty common. Oh, well, we know Octavia's got some money to burn, so feel free. Patchy, can you buy something? I wonder if Patchy has any money. Okay, this yard sale has been a complete fail. Usually our yard sales do really, really well. Hey, Kaori. Oh, she's back. Oh, oh, good. We sold something. That's good, because we just have to go pee real quick. Ah, <sighs> that's better. Oh, she looks angry. Okay, I'm going to do one more sale because our last yard sale didn't do so well. I feel like people are scared to come to our house now. Maybe they've heard the rumors. Oh no, here they come. Maybe they just wait until nighttime because it's like, oh, you can buy fossils. Yay, for $100, you can buy fo old fossils from the haunted house up the road. Yay, $100, $300. Can you not dive in our dumpster? <laughs> Excuse me. I didn't realize we were hanging out with Octavia, but okay. $400, thank you. We got another $80. Okay, Tora's had enough of the yard sailing. She did pretty well. Uh, let's go to bed. And with a bit of luck, her dad won't be too afraid. <laughs> oh, he's in a terrible mood. I swear her dad is way more afraid of things than she is. Oh, also he ages up in two days. So we really, really need to make sure that he has a potion tomorrow. Okay, they're both really low energy, so I'm just gonna let them sleep until the morning. I wish that Grim would protect us from, oh, I thought that was her, that crazy lady. Cause then we'd have no worries cause he's just constantly on our lot. Yay, it's rebate day. Wait, does that mean if we repair the products and furniture that the, then we'll get a rebate? I think we have to buy them brand new. We could try. Uh, it's a beautiful spring day. I love seasons. It makes me so happy that we have seasons in this game. And this is why I always say to everyone, like whenever I get asked what my favorite pack is, I always say seasons, like definitely get it as your first pack. Cause just having weather makes the game so much more beautiful and fun. Oh, we got mail, woo! Oh, we got bills. We've got $3,000 worth of bills. <laughs> Yay, and we made $700 from our writing skills. So that's definitely paying off, like putting all of that extra effort into it. Okay, he needs something to eat. Oh, he was, no, 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 don't go dumpster diving for your food. You have that BLT, okay? Enjoy that BLT. Oh, she's using the new bathroom, love it. I've actually been thinking that I would really love a bidet. I am so tired of like wiping. I don't wanna wipe anymore. Like, why don't we have bidets? They seem like a way more hygienic idea. <gasps> 8,000 from our money tree. I know some of you guys did not like the money tree, but look, it's not cheating if they put it in the game, okay? Okay. <laughs> okay, good girl, get rid of that nasty pasta doll. Wasn't there something over here we had to clean up? Yeah, mop that mysterious thing. And then we can pay our bills. I mean, honestly, we kind of need that money tree to pay our bills. There we go, let's mop that up. And then let's spend a little bit of time with your dad. Share some rebate spirit. I mean, maybe maybe we will get money back. Give him a hug. Talk about handiness. 
His energy is like always drained because of using the seance table. That was another thing I've learned from the comments. I didn't realize how much it drained our energy. I was like, why is he always tired? Oh my gosh, Grim is just chilling out reading a book. I mean, seriously. <laughs> Sebastian Schneider would like to come over to hang out. Is that okay? I mean, sure, Schneider. Just don't start any more fires, Schneiders. Oh, did they just get, um, like, there was like a ghost thing above her head. I think, like, being nice to each other and hugging and stuff makes this a safer space. Is that, is that a thing? I swear I saw that. Maybe I'm imagining things and I'm seeing things. I don't know. Now they're just talking about llamas. And that's just reputation. I swear there was like a ghost thing. Now, does she enjoy writing? Do you enjoy writing or she enjoys painting? <gasps> it really means a lot to me that you make time for me. Just wanted to let you know. Aww, 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 that's so sweet. Okay, let's pay our bills and then let's maybe try writing a short story. Aww, you too. Okay, I think I imagined the ghost thing. <laughs> Oh boy, you need to um, clean this floor. Also, he can make a seance table anywhere, which is pretty cool. Okay, we need to do a lot of sweeping in here. Let's call this the haunted house. The haunted spouse. Huh? See what I did there? House spouse. That's a good title. Let's start a yard sale. Now, did we get our plaque? We got our plaque? We didn't. Also, we need to take Mayor Whiskers over to the pet cemetery. Actually, I don't think I fully checked for the mail. Oh yeah, so we need to check for the mail. We just paid our bills, we didn't actually get the bills. Man, I don't know what happened, but I feel like it's way harder to sell stuff this time I loaded the game. Last time I loaded the game, so many people were coming through. Oh, 900 Smolian, love that. Is her fun going up? It isn't. Okay, so writing is not fun for her. I'm gonna get her to play some chess, nice. Oh, actually, you know what? Instead of starting a yard sale, I think that we should create a seance table and, or circle, not table, um, and summon Bernhilda again, because I just don't want that crazy lady coming to get us. We can make it anywhere. <laughs> That's cool. That's handy. Some of you guys say the seance is interrupted depending on your sim's needs. Like if they go to the toilet, they need, or if they need to go to the toilet, then the sounds just stops, which is kind of annoying because I feel like he's capable of finishing what he needs to do. Torres collected everything. Nice. Did that sounds, did that sounds, I keep saying sounds table work. I don't know. Is oh, yes, it did. Oh, good. So he can sleep soundly tonight. Nope. Don't go dumpster diving. I kind of feel like we should get rid of the dumpster now just because we realized that in it's like broken the fact that you can sell stuff like it really shouldn't sell for that much money so that does feel like cheating now oh no we lost our celebrity level that's too bad is there anything left in the fridge oh the oh, what so she's gonna cry in bed i really don't think that's worth crying in bed about oh jeez. okay well let's see if we replace this for a couple thousand smolians each i wonder if we'll get money back on those I mean, these cost a lot to replace, but they're looking really good. Also, I need to like fix the balustrade. Hi, Grim. <laughs> He's just chilling there all the time. Uh, so really what's left that are big things? We have 1500 for this closet over here. We have this bed that's 12,000 and also the $15,000 violin. And then we also have to paint the whole exterior of the house. So even though we have a money tree, uh, you know, we're still using other ways to make money as well. We're using the market table, we're writing books, we're doing statues or woodwork. We're also doing gardening. What else are we doing? Like you can't say we're not trying, you know? I'm just trying to justify my, my money trees. <laughs> Hey, can we have your grilled cheese sandwich? Thank you. I mean, you don't really need it. Oh, rebate day was awful. Okay, so we didn't get anything back. What are you drinking? An old Yorkfield classic? Um, Tora. I didn't really think Tora was a juice fan, but okay. Oh my gosh, you guys, Grim has moved. I mean, just make yourself right at home, Grim. We love this. We love to see it. We're basically living with Grim now. 
Oh, it's a happy, a happy spectre. Oh, and this is our plaque. Well, that might be perfect above the bed. The golden trilobit. This gift from the Simpsonian Museum Paleontology Department quietly congratulates you on your veritable fossil collection. It comes with a note saying that they aren't the very least bit jealous. Most definitely not. Oh, I love it. Thank you. Thank you, game. Is there anything in here that's handmade that the specter might like? What about like a frog? Can we give them a frog? We didn't make the frog. Oh, hmm. <gasps> this drink. Maybe, maybe it wants a drink. Yes. Do you like whiskey, little specter? Have a good time with this, buddy. Are we like dating now? Do you want to make out or something? That's so weird. Ooh, specter sip. So this means that we might get some skills um, from another sim, another sim soul. So let's see. We've already got pretty high handiness. Oh, oh, it's such a cool um drink. So oh, those are some great big sounds. Whoa, I want to have some of that. Can you actually make drinks like that in real life? I guess you can, like smoky drinks. Mmm, yummy. Oh, we got level three of the snowboarding skill from that drink. Like, I'm not really sure. Oh, what? We can still sell this? Heck yeah. Heck yeah. Maybe this little thing's keeping the crazy lady away. Oh, I might actually get Tora to mop this. Also, it's so crazy seeing how many of you guys are called Tora. So I know a lot of you guys were excited that we picked Tora as a name. But that was really cool. Also, kind of upset that Bernhilda never cleaned up our floors. Like, we had to mop all of those. Grim, are you gonna move or are we gonna, like, sleep with you? Are we gonna sleep with Grim? Oh, I think she's refused. Oh, she won't go to bed because Grim's there? Oh, that's so funny. How long is he gonna sit there reading his book for? Like, I don't know. He seems just massively glitched out. Oh, shish kebab. He is almost aging up. Okay, we need to... Because he ages up in one day. We need to get him a potion. Potion of youth, please. Thank you. Thank you. He's, he's drinking a lot of uh, questionable things. Eric dabbles in juice drinking. Whoa. The potion of youth. Mm. Do you feel different? I don't know. Shall we see? Yay! He's young again for another 12 days. Actually, how's Tora going? Oh my gosh, she ages up in nine days to an el elder. Whoa, short lifespan is crazy. Now she's going to need Potion of Youth as well. <gasps> that is so crazy. She's got 8,000 points. He's got 2,000 points. <gasps> oh my lord. Cheese and whiskers. Well, she's going to need a potion too, but I guess we can hold off for a little while. Just another day repairing the house. Why are these not growing? I mean, actually, they do take a few days to grow. We're going to sell all of our flowers. Beautiful. We have so many cherry trees. Also, ways we can bring back the ghost to life would be the wishing well and ambrosia. But I'm not sure if we're going to do that part of the challenge, but that was an added part of the challenge if we feel like it. Get that money, honey. We've almost made back the bed. Yay! And we got another 500, almost 600 simoleons. Okay, we need to stock this. Ooh, we can also add this to our collection. And we'll do a yard sale. I mean, we are getting so much done today on a Tuesday. I love it. How's your dad going? It's okay. These beds are pretty good. Oh, sneaky little lamp. I'm gonna replace this and this. So really, is it just the bed and the violin we have left? Have we done everything else? I think we have. So we need another, we need 27,000 simoleons. Plus more for the rest of the house. Hey Tina, how you doing? Do you wanna buy something? Let me give you a sales pitch. We got these fossils. I found them myself. Oh, she didn't like that? Well, at least this chick does. What is with her blush? I don't think I ever realized Sophia has such vibrant blush on. It's very bright. Thin brows, bright eyeshadow, very extra. 
But you know what? We like extra. She works it. She's working it. But I am glad there's a pa there's an opac opacity slider now. I love this sim. Julia is so cool. Let's make friends with Julia. Oh, I like Angela too. Friends. Oh, I like Brent as well. It's like all my favorite sims except for Summer Holiday. Hey guys, can you buy this stuff? Because if you do, we can replace the super expensive bed upstairs. Imagine having a $12,000 bed. Holy moly. Also, why can we only fit three fossils at a time? Oh, she looks cool as well. Friends. Why are there so many people here yet no one wants to buy anything? Is this just like a hangout for everyone? I don't understand. <laughs> we only have one more fossil to sell. Just someone buy it. Just someone buy it, please. It's just one last one. Thank you. Thank you. Now I can go pee. Oh, our new friend left. Oh, I liked her. All right, Eric, you're in a good mood. Let me get Eric to dig this up. Maybe get to work on some sculptures. Not the bunny sculpture. So obsessed with bunny sculptures. Holy moly. Oh, I only found upgrade parts. You know what? Maybe we just sell all the upgrade parts. 720 simoleons. Wow. Wow. That's a lot. Okay, let's see. What can we craft that's expensive? A dining table. We can still only just make dining tables as the most expensive thing. I'm disappointed. Mmm, mac and cheese. Okay, I'm starting to get anxious because it's like 8.30 at night and he's still building his table. Phew! And I was about to say we haven't summoned Brunhilde yet, but we can do that now. Okay, we should be fine. We have plenty of energy, but it does degrade our energy by a lot whenever we summon her. This reminds me, I really want to get into more meditation. When I say more, meditation in general, because I don't really do meditation. Gildry, if you interrupt us, I will not be impressed. Because apparently if you live in prolonged state, in a prolonged state of stress, your ability to focus diminishes like rapidly. So if you live with a lot of anxiety, you might not have a very good, yay, hey, Bernhilda. You might ha not have like much of an attention span. And I swear that's happened to me. I know it happens to a lot of streamers as well because you're constantly like focusing on a lot of stuff and multitasking. It means your ability to focus on one thing is more difficult. I listened to a psychologist and apparently meditation can help fix this. Bernhilda is like flirting with us. I kind of want to flirt back. I mean, it's it's kind of weird. I totally get it, but are these floating? Wait, am I going crazy? Are these floating? No, they're not floating, are they? Oh my god, I'm. Hold on a second. Am I going crazy? Is this why they're not growing? No, they're on the ground. Okay, sorry, I, I, I was going crazy. <laughs> Confirmed. Because <gasps> I feel like Eric, you know, he's all alone in this house. He's kind of living forever. Oh, she didn't like his pickup line? Ow. Well, that's disappointing. She's like, you only use me to protect the house. You don't actually like me. Which is kind of true. She's getting some rest. I really do feel like we've figured out, you know, how this, this whole thing works. This haunted house. Like, I feel like we're living in it pretty comfortably now. Although it does feel wrong to woohoo with someone you can summon whenever you want. Like, there's something about that. Like, the power balance isn't quite right if they can't summon you speaking of weird this is weird like i don't i mean i don't mind him hanging around it'd just be nice if he wasn't in our bedroom you know what i'm saying actually you know what i just realized if we did want to bring the ghost back to life we would have needed to strengthen all the tombstones because once they're gone i'm pretty sure they're gone might uh, just remove this and how do we strengthen bonds to physical world? Okay, they're still all here. Just so we still have that opportunity if we want to. <gasps> Maybe the Grim Reaper is like waiting for us to die because we're avoiding death. One does not plead with death before the reaping. See, he's waiting. He's, death is waiting on us and we're cheating. Oh, look at our ghost friends. We've got Olga and we've got Louisa. Oh my gosh, Olga and Louisa. So cute. I've got to be honest, I cannot wait to fix this house because I cannot stand these Sims constantly being scared all the time and everything breaking and ghosts being everywhere. It's driving me nutballs. 
All right, you guys, well, we've survived another night, another several nights in this haunted home, and these two are still, uh, still going strong. With our money trees, we're able to almost have fully fixed the home, which means in the next part, hopefully, we may get to the point of being able to take away the haunted aspect of this home. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you're having a lovely morning, afternoon, or evening, wherever you are in the world. I look forward to speaking to y'all soon. Bye, guys.